Hello everyone, this is Rick and thanks for joining. This is the 18th Excel tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to remove duplicate entries. So what I've done here is I've made a list of, of names and addresses and what date they were updated and you'll notice there's a couple of them in here that have been uh, uh, duplicated. For example, Bolton is on row 3 and row 9 here and there's a couple others in here too but you'll notice they have different uh, updated dates. So the first thing that you want to do in in Excel 2007, there's a new option. If you highlight all these, if you highlight your range of cells and then click on Data, you'll notice there's now a Remove Duplicate option. If you go ahead and click that, then you'll get an option box that comes up, and you can choose what you want to check on. So we're going to go ahead and, and match up on first name and last name. We're going to say OK. And it's going to tell you three duplicate values found and removed, eight unique values remain. So we're going to say OK. So you'll notice uh, the extra Bolton was removed here, this entry for Michael Bolton. So, but you'll notice the updated date was 1999. So I'm going to go do a, I'm going to uh, back those changes out, and you'll notice that the other one was updated in 2003. So sometimes you might want to do a little bit more analysis before you just go and remove duplicates because what that remove duplicates option does is it removes the first duplicate that it finds it doesn't take into account which one was updated later and so forth so one of the things you can do is you can do what we call conditional formatting which I reviewed in an earlier tutorial but you can highlight your highlight the cells that you want to you want to um, format so in this case we're going to look at first name and last name and we're going to say conditional formatting under con under the home uh, menu click highlight cells rules and choose duplicate values and then what will happen is say OK it will highlight all of the cells that are duplicates okay then what you can do is now you can take a look and decide analyze them a little bit more and to make this a little bit simpler you can do any number of things here. You could highlight them all. You could sort the data. Go into the data option. Go to sort and you could sort it by we'll say updated from oldest to newest. Right? So you could sort it by date. But another thing you can do now is you can sort by the conditional formatting. So or the color of the cell. So we're going to go ahead and go to data, sort and I'm going to do something here. I'm going to change this to be last name and sort from A to Z, but then I'm going to add a level and I want to sort by last name again, but this time I want to sort on my cell color and then I'm going to put I'm going to choose the pull down menu here and I'm going to choose the color uh, that's default that uh, it selected here and I'm going to say you can do on top or on bottom. I'll say on top. And now you have it so you can analyze each duplicate and decide which one manually manually you want to delete. So there's a couple options there. And I think that's all I wanted to show you for today. Thanks for joining. Please feel free to send send me comments and notes about what other topics you want to learn. Thanks.